Hello, hello, hello. Guys, I just came here real, real pissed off. And uh, I don't know how I'm going to say this. We that follow up this party in Villa Medellin, we expect people to behave and uh, also people to enjoy we are not uh, follow up these be fan base uh, whatever position sites you have even the haters are doing much better compared to certain behaviors that in the last five days those people that are saying are loyal to I am Ara they start to have a very, very dangerous language here on the YouTube, in particular, uh, exposing other people's data, personal data. And then now we have seen this guy called Official Slim Boy K. He have access again to the compound and uh, come with these ridiculous comments and language like Villa Medellin is sinking and then the expressions of nigger and the word F remember the fan base of Ayamara is not only Kenyans are uh, worldwide so if we gonna watch these things people come here with the N word and with F word and with mislead titles Villa Medellin sinking. What people gonna react? What is this all about? This person is sending a message, a very, very, very clear message to Ayamara that is nothing. Not only that, he sent us a signal that things are going highly wrong in this party. People, they are losing control of the situation. This post of shell accept at Ayamara of official slim boy. <laughs> Come on, does not make sense. Does not make sense at all. And the guy comes with a picture of Ayamara. So basically he's like oh, like Shagarab. You remember? Mr. Lava Lava. What the when it became um, homophobic. This is the same situation we are seeing here. It is Ayamara homophobic. Man, if anybody out there watching this, oh, this thing has been, can be corrected. This guy can be chased out of the party because now this guy is saying he's going to perform how an homophobic person can uh, perform? Somebody that used those gangster words, the F and the N, what is all about this? This is no longer entertainment. Well, to be honest, if things go like this, I'll be the first one to distance myself from everything that is as achieved and look somewhere else for better entertainment. This is what always I say it here. You can be greatest, but you can't hide the truth. And this is what we are seeing here is people attempted to damage the reputation of the, all the work that it took seven years to build, to be destroyed, just like that. I have referred here that this 
this work that Ayamara has done does not benefit him at all. He will carry on. He benefits the people. They get those gifts, those cameras, the reputation of the village. Now, if we have this guy come damage the reputation of this YouTuber village, yeah, you might say, is one in a thousand. Is that one in a thousand that will make an impact? Remember the haters are just four haters, but look what these four haters trigger the avalanche of positivity. But this guy, it does not trigger the avalanche of positivity. Is an ego. I don't know if you guys get this point. This guy really, really, what he says here is very dangerous. And the comments of the people, especially in the United States of America, they're starting to react to his video. And then they're talking about uh, it should not be allowed to say these words because these are offensive words and highly offensive words. Yeah, I know it's an entertainment, this is the YouTube street, but we need to be careful. It's not only you that's listening. You want to be famous, you want to be whatever, you don't use and abuse. Like now, these guys talk about is going to perform. One drop has told him to bring the mu his own music to perform. So, somebody else out there will be looking to one, one drop and say, no, 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 no. I will not hire this guy. This guy wants hire this homophobic person, so he will bring me another homophobic person here and start insult. You don't want to have an entertainment company that's come to you, party, whatever, and start be rude, insult you, your friends and your whatever you invite. This get. Now, one drop is talking about uh, Nyambuanzi festival. Good idea. So, but now let's see the consequences of this. We have this lady came from Netherlands. She have a very good reputation. Now she's mingled with this kind of person. What she ne next time she say no? I'm not gonna go mingle with the homophobic individual. I don't want to be part of that. Life is much better out there compared to going there. Really, this is very offensive. And uh, today, I don't know how to say. This is too much to be reading, sitting here, and try to enjoy something, and you come and read this guy. First of all, this guy... In the first instance, when he went to Villa Medellin, he went with a very clear to create a damage, and that is his intention to create a damage. And there is the first damage. Boom, bingo. Villa Medellin sinking. How, how long this building been erected? What he knows about building? Is an homophobic. I will not be happy to listen to his music. Nobody will be happy to see and hear and associate this guy with Ayamara. Remember Ayamara's brand. There is a Frederick Mara and then there is Ayamara, the brand. That's what I say 70% of these people after this party. We're going to see and hear things here we could not even imagine. We're going to see how people are ungrateful for everything. I hope you or anybody out there reach out to Irene, Pablo K.E., One Drop, and make aware this is not ideal thing. As a fan base, also, as an analyst of this character, I don't see the need 
for this individual mingle with people, good hearts and good heal, will. They are giving back to this community. So now, others might be thinking, oh, why am I should invest? Or why am I should visit this place? If this person can do things the way he's doing, if I get there, I, it might be offended. I might be offended. I've been watching my Yugno, my Popo, uh, Mike Ventures, and even Max Swan. I never heard these words. What the hell is going on? I'm glad. I'm glad that YouTube has sent somebody to see this thing. Yeah, it's a case, but that case can blow out of It will blow. I'm quite sure it will blow. People, they will be offended and people will be un unsubscribed, take a day subscriptions and move and go look for another content, enjoy somewhere else. Instead, be sitting there and be offended. You can't be famous. You can't be so important by using these words and try to abuse somebody that has already achieved. This is why we Africans have a problem. And this is the problem of Africans. We are never satisfied with our own selves. I have seen this new channel that uh, arose now from Mama Annie, uh, daughter. I'm happy to see she have a channel, everything, but come on. It needs to be more creative, more build it up. But what I see is more begging compared to nothing. And this is what most of the people, they coming to Ayamara for begging. Help me, support me. I will not help you and will not support you if you don't do something that I feel there is a cause that I can identify myself with you. There is something to learn. There is something to help. Be a content creator is not just recording a tree or people walking the street. People, come on, let's make sense here. This guy is dangerous. Me, I will never watch this guy. To be honest, I, I came, I came across his, his channel because it shows up on the quick, on the fast feeds. But come on, misleading information. Yeah, there is a lot of misleading information, but not that kind of misleading information because we've been follow up this story since the inception. When Ayamara went around the world in the last series and invited people. Now this guy is not being officially invited, nothing. Go create problems. First instance, become conflictive. Now he comes further aggressive. We don't interest the ear to sit and look for people's conflicts. Please, somebody out there, kick this guy out. This is not good. This is no content creation. This is to show how we, as Africans, every time we go the same path of ignorance, be stupid. We are not able to get ourselves in a straight line. Mutual respect, consideration, and knowledge others. You don't lose nothing by knowledge somebody. How great the person is. And but we Africans, the best always is to destroy. And then you destroy everything, and then there is nothing even left for you for yourself. This is what I see here. Thank you.